Hello and welcome to Channel 42 where we talk about life, the universe, and a little bit of everything. This is another Factorio NoobTube video and what we're going to be discussing today is the Factorio interface. So this is basically your really, really early setup. I've done maybe 10 minutes of gameplay, done just a couple of things. Um, you're, you start with a stone furnace, a burning mining drill, and I think I just made this boiler which needs water and produces steam. So what we're looking at, you're, you are this guy. WASD moves you around, of course. A couple of the most important keys are Q, which uh, quits most screens, and E, which opens up most screens. Um, <clears throat> so Q also is your pipette tool. So if you've got something on the ground and you want to pick it up uh, and place another one, press Q and you can see it duplicates that. Um, <clears throat> e is uh, the inventory tab in this because you use it so much. So you'll notice you've got all of your inventory right here on the left side. You can drag any one of these down to your quick bar to make it so you don't have to press E to grab them. This is just a shortcut to what's already in your inventory, so nothing new or special here. And then you press E again uh, to close that out. So E opens, E closes. If you have something in your hand and you want to put it away, you press Q. So I grab the boxes, I'm done placing my two boxes, press Q, and that goes away back to just a normal cursor. Um, right click is the general pickup or harvest. So you could harvest copper ore, just right clicking on that. Harvest stone, right clicking on that. Same with uh, iron ore. Those are three of the really early resources. There's um, uh, uranium, oil, and um, a couple of others. Those you can't just harvest normally. Same with trees, right click on trees, you chop those up, and uh, rocks. There are rocks around that give you piles of stone and um, sometimes a little bit of coal as well. Coal is the other really early resource, the, the one you need the most really early on. So that's why I recommend, as a, just a quick pointer, putting your burning mining drill on the coal. Um, like I've mentioned in a previous video, I'll mention it again here, these little arrows on the burning mining drills and on as you get into electric drills, um, th that's where it's going to be placing your ore. So if I put just a little bit of ore in here, and just to give you an idea of this interface, this is what's coming out, this is what I've put in. And you'll notice if you hover over that, it tells you the options for fuel right there. Of course, you only have wood and coal in the very early game. So we're going to put just a little bit of in there. Now, you can click it, drop it, that's the whatever is in your hand. Shift left click does the same thing. Shift right click does half of whatever you just did. So that was a shift, a right click, and you'll notice it cuts that stack in half and puts it in there. Now, you'll notice that since I'm fully zoomed in, this little pile, that's coal on the ground. You can press F on the keyboard to pick that up. If you drop something on the ground or have something on the ground, F picks it up, but you really don't want to stand there. So we build a box and place it right there so that it, the arrow is dumping that coal into the box. Again, right click harvests it, whether it's an item on the ground like a box, that's a right click, or a um, stone furnace. So the idea in Factorio to get started, really your, your goal is to be as lazy as possible. Um, try, unlike in uh, Minecraft or some other games, you want to automate things. You want to do as little work as possible to, to actually get things working on their own. In the first, I don't know, maybe 30 or 40 minutes, you do have to do a lot of it yourself, walking around, picking things up, like you pick up the coal from here, and that's another quick, you can click, drag, and put it in your own inventory, or control, left click, picks up the whole stack from whatever is in the box, actually the whole contents of the box, even if there's multiple things in the box. So I'll demonstrate that. Control, left click, and I've just grabbed everything from in that box. And then I can go here, and you can manually put it in. Click and drag, click and drag, or you can do the same thing. Control, uh, let's see, grab the item, and then hold control, and click on where you want to drop it. And then grab or click where you want to put it, and control. And you'll notice we've got the fuel in the fuel spot, and the iron ore being made into iron plates. And of course, that's the foundation for what you're going to be building. Now, of course, I'm, I've run out, so I need to go collect more of this material and, um, and get started. So that's kind of the introduction, and, uh, and that's going to be the end of this video. I'll get into some of the nuances of uh, the rest of the stuff 
and just a minute.